Hello everybody and welcome back to World of Tanks. My name is Spartan Elite 43 and tonight we are in the M55 on airfield. So, we're running with a platoon and I can't go into everybody. I know Tropic Hornets here, I think, maybe Big Minivan um, and a few other guys. Deluxe Bullet, I think. Um, and they're running their usual tanks. I mean, I, I can't really usually pay attention to what they run because I'm just worried about what I'm doing. But what I can say is, it's a new week, and I know you guys missed me, and I missed you. So let's get this underway. Now we're on airfield, and we spawned in the, uh, I guess it would be the east. Yeah, east. So I like to come over here to this back corner, not all the way towards the water's edge, even though a lot of people have been getting up into that little hole. I don't like to go up there. Uh, because it doesn't allow you to move after you're up there. I mean, you can get out if you don't drop all the way down in. But I just don't like being able to not relocate when I need to. So we got a bat chat right here. First shot. So, shot out. And we we hit so far away from where we actually aimed that I'm actually kind of stunned. Like That was a long ways off of where I aimed. But it was in the reticle, so... You get some bad RNG sometimes. But if that's the way the first shot's going to go, this could be a long match. <sighs> Jag Pansy 100. He's begging for it. He's out in the open. And he's starting to move, so shot out. He turns broadside on, and we splash two tanks. So I don't know who else was over there with him, but I also hit somebody else. Ooh, T95. There we go. Big, heavy, ugly target. Uh, the bat chat's on center hill. Can't touch him. And, of course, the 121's in a place I can't touch either. So, Load it up. Let it rip. might as well just go ahead and get ready to shoot the guys that were lit up. But, again, they all disappear. Now, I'm going to start Focus firing on the center because everybody's starting to get bottled up as usual. And this is what gets a lot of people into trouble with artillery in this map because you get bottled up and then Artie can just sit here and unleash on you. Like these tank destroyers are about to find out. And Fire. shot out. And the shell lands again so far away from where I aimed that it's not even funny. Like you couldn't have landed any further away from where I aimed. And it's nothing I'm doing wrong. It's just, it's bad RNG. It literally will not allow me to hit them. It hit all the way up into the middle of the map. Now, I know they're on slight hills, so that's part of it. Shot out on the Waffen. 1257. That's a final hit. Good lord. About time we do some damage. <laughs> you get the great shot from the teammates because they just watched a Waffen Trager Alfie 100 get absolutely wrecked. Which is what an 8 inch howitzer should do to a no armored tank. T95 is rolling up in, so let's go ahead and uh, introduce him to the party. And shot out. Fire. Direct hit. Now that was into the front of his armor, but if it landed on top of him, yeah, nah, unfortunately it didn't. But it is what it is. We probably hit him for 450, 500. You know, your standard roll when you hit the armor of a tank. And so T95 is going to back around the corner, but that, that Jag E100 is begging for it. Shot out. 508, right into the front of him. Now he's like, Daggum, Artie, get off me. Shoot somebody else. And I'm like, well, I have shot more more than one person. But, I mean, you've, you've funneled yourself in. There's nowhere for you to go, and I'm in the perfect place to attack you, so... I'm just waiting for these guys to spot him again. He will be spotted. You can see Tropic, jo Tropic got dumped from the party and ended up joining back in. Kind of hoping these guys come up the hill here. I'm wasting a lot of time looking. Oh, look at this. Another Waffen Trager Alfie 100. So... Shot out. Clearing gun. 1739. 
That's two Waffentrager Alpha 100s that I've absolutely wrecked. That's a paddling, folks. 1700 damage is one of those game changing hits that just makes the person quit. Like, that would make most people just quit playing for the night after they die. <laughs> that's, a, that's a rough, rough amount of damage. But you're in a tank with no armor, you're sitting out in the open, you know artillery's against you, you're gonna get hit eventually. And look at this Death Star. Backside to an 8 inch howitzer. Shot out. Direct hit. Now, he was backside on. So that should have been an amazing hit. Another big hit. But I don't know because I can't see him. Unfortunately, it wasn't. It was an average hit. Probably 750. Maybe 800. But he's on the other side of the hill now, so I can't hit him. I'm going to try to get a shot in the Indian Panzer. Nope, never mind. Don't worry about it, they'll kill him. So, I'm still right in right in the thick of things. I'm watching both sides of the map on the mini-map. I marked location. where that Death Star was so that everybody knows, hey, there's a Death Star behind you. And now you'll see those mediums are starting to turn around and head back that direction. So I'm assuming they're going to go deal with him. And here's our, our friend, the Jaggy 100. Once again, he's gotten himself into a position where I can hit him. So shot out. Gun. And we splash him. Unfortunately, we track him, but that's all we did. Now they're starting to shoot him in the backside. They bounced off of him because Jags have a ridiculous amount of armor. But he's in trouble. There they put another shot on him. He's not sure what he wants to do. I leave him for them because there's a heavy tank about to shoot him in the backside. And so I fire at the E5. And we overshoot by a mile. So you can see where I don't have the best RNG in this one. Yeah, I've had some really big hits. But those are just because those tanks are have no armor. And I managed to hit their turret. Now the Death Star is rolling in. He wants it. He wants it. Come on. Can I help our guy out? Shot out. And we overshoot. But it looks like that Leopard's going to actually win that fight anyway. Three tanks left. Two tanks left. Zoom in on the E5. She's loaded. And come on, give it to me. Ah, oh, he got around the corner and I can't hit him, so we don't get that one. But we got seven hits, one kill, two massive hits, and this should be a good game. So we ended up with 5,500 damage, one kill, fourth or fifth on the leaderboard, so not bad. We end up with another Gore's medal. Uh, so if you like what I'm doing, punch that like button, leave a comment below, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and as always, I will see you in the next video.